Good morning students. Today we are going to start our third chapter that is advanced feature of my tux paint. Now what is tux paint? Tux paint is a wonderful drawing software for children. Let us look at its unique features. First, it increases the creativity of children, provides large variety of de design tools. Second, it is very easy to use and requires only basic knowledge of mouse skills. Third, Penguin tells more about tools and sub-tools available in text program. Fourth, it provides facility to add personalized stamps to the drawing. Fourth, it plays funny sound effects when you select any tool. Images can be saved and loaded directly as thumbnails without using any name or file name. In the previous class, we all have learned how to use the paint freehand write drawing tool along with various brush shapes, line tools to draw beautiful pattern and magic tool to add some magical effects. Now, in this chapter, we will learn about the magic tools. More magic tools in Tux Paint, there are various magic effects which allow us to draw wonderful pattern. Let us learn some of the pattern effects magic tool. First is mosaic effect. It is used to apply a pattern of many small colored pieces of stones on the canvas. Well, how to do the mosaic effect? Open a new canvas, draw the sunset scene or you can select any colored background. Now click the magic tool and select mosaic effect on the selector. Now bring the magic wand to the canvas and click on it. The canvas will be filled with, with mosaic effect. Click it further to change its color. You can see in the picture that mosaic effect, mosaic effect. It is very important and very useful effect present in magic tools. Tux paint supports vector graphics also, which means that we can draw images that can be zoomed up to 100 times. Second is Kaleidoscope effect, <clears throat> that is Kaleidoscope effect. This tool is used to create freehand patterns. The most amazing features of this tool is that even if we move the magic when from a single point, it draws from all the four directions. Let us learn how to use it by drawing the following figure. First, just select the green background. Now click the magic tool and select kaleidoscope effect from the selector. After that, pick any color and bring the magic wand on the canvas. After that, Click and drag the mouse as you wish. A pattern will start appearing on the canvas. After designing the pattern, fill color in it. So in kaleidoscope effect, we can create freehand patterns. Freehand patterns can be created with the help of kaleidoscope effect. So don't forget it. And also in kaleidoscope effect, patterns start appearing on the canvas. Third is emboss effect. This magic tool gives a raised effect to an object from the surface which you have drawn. What to do? Just select the emboss effect from the selector. Bring the magic wand over the image on the canvas and drag the mouse to emboss the image. Third, observe the change in the image. Now, what is emboss effect? It gives the raised effect to an object from the surface which we have drawn. You can see in the picture, see, it is already circled. This is emboss effect. 
embossed effect and where can you find this effect from the magic tool okay now one more let us know tux paint is translated into 129 languages fourth effect lighten effect as the name suggests this tool is used to lighten the color of any object to use this effect what to do just select the lighten effect from the selector after selecting the effect from the selector drag the magic wand on half the area of an object which is already shown in the figure now observe that area where we had applied the tool become lighter than the other half you can see the first half and the second half in the second half you can see the light color of the drawing see this flower which we i have painted on this on the screen you are able to see so what is the use of light and effect the use of this tool is or the use of light and effect is to lighten the color of any object and uh, now the next topic is storyboard what is storyboard storyboard is a series of pictures that provide a visual layout of events in a story it is just like a comic book you have seen the comic book ha huh. it is just like that which displays the characters with some actions and dialogues it brings life to the script by showing the key scenes as to how the objects will look who will be present in the story and what actions will take place let us learn how to create the storyboard in tux paint for the story we are taking a story the lion and the mouse scene one just imagine lion and one mouse click on the new tool select the dark green background as we are seeing in the forest na to click on the open button now apply the glass tile effect on the background with the help of which tool magic tool click on the text tool and select the white color from the color spell bring the pointer to the a drawing area and type the lion and the mouse now we have written the lion and the mouse now we can increase the size and also we can decrease the text size and other scenes can be also drawn with the help of these tools now the next topic is how to delete a drawing to delete a saved drawing or in a file in tux paint just select the tool open tool all the saved files will be appear choose the drawing which we have to delete now click on the erase button present at the bottom right of the screen tux paint will prompt the message erase this picture just select yes to delete the drawing the selected drawing will be erased from tux paint and if you have selected no button the selected drawing will not be deleted so where you can you have to open we have to open the open tool then all the files will be appear we have to choose the files from that we have to delete whatever we want to delete one or more uh, files click on the erase button present at the bottom right of the screen tux paint will prompt the message erase this picture select yes to delete the drawing and what will happen the selected drawing will be erased from the tux paint and at the same time if you have selected no button the selected drawing will not be deleted so now you have come to know how to delete a drawing or a slide and how to select got it. now class learn this how to delete a save file in tux paint now the last topic of this chapter is quit tool what is the use of quit tool quit tool help us to exit the tux paint program 
what to do just click on the quit tool tux paint will prompt the message do you really want to quit if you select yes i am done and you have to save the drawing now the brain developer two activities are there fill in the blanks and true false dash tool gives the raised effect to an object from the drawing surface second dash tool help you to exit from the text paint program third dash is the series of pictures that provide a visual layout of the events in the story fourth slideshow is a series selected dash often displayed on the screen fifth text paint is translated in how many languages and see the hints are given you have to just fill it state the true or false first pictures in a slideshow are marked with a b c and so on second mosaic effect lightens the color of an object third rosette effect tool is used to draw patterns in the shape of a rose fourth text paint is not freely available fifth you can draw flowers with the help of the flower magic tool class i think now you are able to understand whatever we i have taught and please go through the chapter thank you